Most customers will look at at least one review of a product before they go and buy it. So it's super important if you have an e-commerce store to have some form of reviews on there. And a newish feature on Squarespace is the ability to add reviews. So you can add store-based reviews, product-based reviews, and also Etsy reviews now. So I'm gonna show you how to add them and then how to enable them on your site. What we wanna do first off is go into selling. Then we're gonna go down to selling tools. And then you can see here, product reviews. So we click on this and we're just gonna turn it on. Nice and simple, it's gonna be turned on straight away. So Squarespace is gonna tell us, uh, review request emails get sent 14 days after an order is fulfilled in the orders panel. And we can go to the orders panel and check all the orders. But basically what we wanna do, if we wanna edit this, is click on the cog, and then you can see we've got all of our review options here. So first off, request reviews. If we toggle this off, we're not gonna be following up with our customers 14 days later. That's now disabled. But if we enable it again, then it'll reload and then it'll be enabled. So. Email notifications, we will get these when people leave a review. I would recommend always having this on just because you can then take a look at them, respond to them, you know, whatever it may be. And then if we click down on display, you can see request and import reviews to display. So what gets imported on the product page, you can have product and store reviews, store reviews only or product reviews only. And then if you're an Etsy seller, you can import your Etsy reviews. So click import, you'll just log into Etsy, import them and then you can toggle imported reviews as well so if you are an etsy seller it makes sense to connect that up bring all your reviews over and just have more social proof in your store if you want to go a step further and actually customize the automated email that squarespace sends just click here customize the email edit email and then we can go into here and change this up so obviously it's going to be the site title then you can change the text in here text in here you got your product in here. So it's obviously going to tell them what they bought. And then the CTA to write a review is in here. Now you can add blocks in as well. So we just click plus and then you can add text images, a line like so, and you can change the length of that line or you can add a space block. So it doesn't quite give you as many options as it would on a standard email campaign from Squarespace, but it is nice just to be able to customize it a little bit, even if it's just the text and you know, if you, if you wanted to go a step further, you could have like an image of you or the team or whatever, just to make it a little bit more personalized. So it's completely up to you how you play that. You'll notice you can get rid of these blocks if you wish, but you can't get rid of this block or this block, obviously. However, you can move them about if you want. So let's say, you know, you want to put the product right at the top just to make sure, you know, they know, okay, this is exactly what I've just bought. And then at the bottom, you can leave the review. Or again, if you wanted to move the review right up to the top, you can do that, get that CTA in straight away, completely up to you how you want to play it. So once you're happy with that, all you need to do is hit save and save again. Before we do that, if we go into email and then subject line, you can change what the subject line is when it gets sent to the person and then email preview. So, you know, when you see an email come through and it's got the preview underneath, we can put in something like, Please, please, please give us a great review or, or something to that effect. Maybe not quite as pushy, but anyway, once you're happy, hit save, hit save again. And then that automatically starts firing out on the next email. So whenever the next 14 days is up, this is the email that's going to go out to that customer. So you go back, you can see it in real time here and there we go. So that's how you set reviews up in your Squarespace store.